will submit proof of vaccination or take biweekly COVID-19 tests. The Milwaukee Public Schools Board unanimously approved a new vaccine mandate to impact all district employees outlined in a special school board meeting tonight. Fox 6's Sam Kramer joins us live and Sam, the teachers union offers support for this plan. Yeah, hi, Gabrielle. The Milwaukee Teachers Education Association said this would be pivotal to school safety, noting just last week 150 students and staff tested positive for COVID-19. Now, the plan also includes a $100 incentive program just passed by the board in tonight's meeting that only applies for students ages 12 and up, while some opponents feared such a mandate will only drive some staff away. This same week, Morse Middle School moved to virtual learning with 3% or more of its total school population testing positive for COVID-19. We are tired of watching meaningless half measures from our city government, and we do not want to see a half measure from this administration or board. Milwaukee Public Schools administrators are asking the board to require all employees be vaccinated against COVID-19 by November 1st, or take a weekly COVID-19 test. Employees that do not comply would be placed on unpaid leave and could face termination despite mixed reaction from public commenters. We are in a dire situation in Milwaukee and our schools are seeing the intensifying consequences of the community spread. I know we are all ready for this pandemic to be over and for life to return to normal. And I believe the vaccine is a good step towards that. However, I don't believe in mandating it. Board members then question the administration on its recommendation, including concerns a mandate could drive employees away. Concern is that we're going to lose more uh, faculty and staff and that um, the mandates that we're putting in place here in this platform will not be implemented correctly in our schools. The plan includes recommending incentives for staff and eligible students to get vaccinated, a move the district says could cost more than $4 million if offering $100 each. Now, the vaccine mandate does include religious and medical exemptions if they are proven. Uh, again, late tonight, they just approved a incentive program for students. The teachers union had been asking for both a mandate and an incentive program for teachers, as much as $500 per teacher. But it sounds like that is not going to happen. A member of the city attorney's office advised the board in tonight's meeting that opening up both avenues could be viewed as discrimination. We're live tonight in Milwaukee. Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News. All right, Sam, thank you.